Uh, this is Friendship 7. I'll try to describe what I'm in here. Uh, I am in a, a big mass of some very small particles uh, that are brilliantly lit up like they're luminescent. I never saw anything like it. They're around the little, they're coming by the capsule. Uh, and they look like little stars, a whole shower of them coming by. Uh, they swirl around the capsule and go in front of the window, and they're all brilliantly lighted. Uh, they probably average maybe uh, seven or eight feet apart, but I can see them all down below me also. Uh, negative, negative. They're very slow. Uh, they're not going away from me more than maybe... Uh, uh, three or four miles per hour. They're going at the same speed I am, approximately. They're only very slightly under my speed. Over. Uh, they do. They do have a different motion, though, from me, uh, because they swirl around the capsule and then depart uh, back the way that I am looking. Are you receiving? Over. There are literally thousands of them. Uh, this is Friendship 7. Uh, am I in contact with anyone? Over. Uh, this has been going on since about 1 uh, plus 1, 5. Over. Just after I remarked about the sunset, I looked back up and looked out the window, and uh, all the little swirl of particles was going by. Over. Uh, this is Friendship 7 uh, broadcasting in the blind. The uh, sunrise uh, has come up behind in the periscope. It was brilliant in the scope, a brilliant red as it approached the horizon and came up. And just as, the, as I looked back up out the window, I had uh, literally thousands of small luminous particles uh, swirling around the capsule and going away from me at maybe uh, three to five miles per hour. Uh, now that I am out in the bright sun, uh, they seem to have disappeared. Uh, it was just as the sun was coming up. I can still see just a few of them now, even though the sun is up some uh, 20 degrees above the horizon. Uh, I still have some of these little particles coming around the capsule occasionally here. I can see them against the dark sky even on the day side. Over. Roger, I understand. Friendship 7, uh, we'll give blood pressure check. Uh, I still have some of these particles that I cannot identify coming around the capsule occasionally. Over. Uh, Roger, how big are these particles? Uh, uh, very small. I would indicate they're of the order of a sixteenth of an inch or smaller. Uh, they drift by the window, and uh, I can see them against the dark sky. Uh, just as at, just at sunrise, there were literally thousands of them. It looked like just a myriad of stars. Over. Roger, are they uh, losing volume or floating with you? Over. Uh, some of them uh, float almost with me. Most of them appear to be moving at about three to five miles an hour away from me. I'm going just a little faster than they are. Over. Roger. Uh, only really unusual thing so far beside ASCS trouble uh, were the little particles, luminous particles around the capsule, just thousands of them, uh, right at sunrise over the Pacific. Over. Uh, this is Friendship 7. I do not think they were from my control jets. Negative. Over. Uh, Roger, Friendship 7. This is Canton. We have TM solid. Uh, go ahead. Over. Uh, Roger, this is Friendship 7, and now that sunrise is starting, I have all these little particles coming around the capsule again, just at sunrise. Uh, Roger, Friendship 7. I also can see the light on my... Uh, on steam from the thruster when I operate it. Over. Uh, this is Friendship 7. I think my, uh, I can see a little bit of steam spitting against the dark sky here occasionally from my pitch down manual thrust. Over. Hi, uh, Roger. Uh, this is Friendship 7. All these little particles, there are thousands of them, and they're not coming from the capsule. There's something that's already up here. 
lights are there all over the sky, way out. I can see them uh, as far as I can see in each direction almost. Roger, Friendship 7. Uh, this is Friendship 7. I'm trying to get some pictures of these particles that are outside here, over. Uh, Friendship 7, this is Canton. Uh, we also have no indication that your landing bay might be destroyed, over. Uh, Roger, did someone report landing bag could be down? Over. Uh, negative. We had a uh, request to monitor this and to ask you if you heard any flapping uh, when you had high capsule rates. Uh, negative. This was. Over. Well, I think they probably thought these particles I saw might have come from that. But these are, there are thousands of these things and they go out for, it uh, looks like miles in each direction from me and they move by here very slowly. I saw them at the same spot on the first orbit, over. Hi, uh, Roger. Are you still seeing the particles around here? Uh, uh, negative. I don't seem to see them around here on this side. I saw a few, uh, just a few, uh, just after I left Canaveral and turned around facing forward. Uh, they were coming toward me at that time. I was going, uh, so I know that they are not coming from the capsule at all. Uh, I saw the particles in, uh, in huge quantities at each sunrise so far. Over.